1970, 13th Avenue and 76th Street, Bensonhurst. Joe Colombo's drones leaned on parking meters and consorted openly, telling little girls about Bacala, Bracarab, and Brajol. And Greg Scarpa Sr. was intimidating the mob, the police world, the FBI, even employed him to threaten the Klan. We worked for all those dead men. Joey Bruiser, Benny Benson, Sally Scarpa, Greg and his son, babysitting for the children of mistresses, to spinning disco gay to running numbers. Greg Scarpa himself got in my face twice. I was only 16, maybe less, and screamed his death threats once in a phone booth and once with two henchmen when they kicked in my mother's apartment door and threatened my life. I didn't back down. I stood up to him, like I will with you. He died in prison with AIDS from his lieutenant's blood, while I still roam as a runaway slave, sexy and happy and free.